The end to the radius endgame is upon me, and as it approaches, I can feel myself gaining confidence. I hear somebody running around like he thinks he can take me, like some kind of crazy fool. <laughs> you know there is such a thing as false confidence, right? I'm the fastest gunslinger in all the West. Ow, shit. I didn't reload it. These days, I feel more relaxed even when I'm in the dreaded radius. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. While recording background music for these videos has been less relaxing. What the hell? <laughs> How do I fix this? Since it is the end game times, I wanted to get the most powerful and impressive rifle I could get my hands on. A decision that I'm sure surprises few of you. So I took a trip to the gun range to see which super duper powerful firearm would suit me best. The decision is to be made here upon this day. And that decision is which gun I'm going to use for end game activities. We're gonna look at the security level five guns that I've never had access to. I knew I wanted to get a security level 5 exclusive, and I had a few recommendations from you guys to try out. Some of these guns I've never heard anyone talk about at all in the comments, and it just makes me feel so bad for the gun, you know? Which one's that? FN-17? The FN-17 was the first rifle where I could actually see if it was in semi-auto or auto-firing mode. So, automatic. oh now see this one I can actually tell what the little icons say. Like that's probably automatic. There is the F. N17 A pricey gun to maintain The M14 handles pretty good But has no rails That's lame Has low reliability This has really high Okay, so this is still better for me In my case doesn't look nearly as enticing in the stats. So, tail mount. It has like no places for rail B stuff. You can't put any toys on it. What fun is that? I want this. This is what I want. The question is, how much does it cost? I'm sure it can't be too bad. What, seven? Eight grand? Nine? Tops? Twelve thousand dollars. Is this legal? Is that price gouging? What's the MSRP on that sh Something's not right. I mean, I want it. There's no way to haggle here. It's a computer. Can't haggle with this blasted computer. Well, guys, it's time to do some missions. I could have done some missions, but the real goal here was to make some big money. Like, huge money. Like, close to 20k. And by the way... Hey, I forgot I have this. For some reason, I've always thought that if these crappy guns were in really bad shape, I had to pay to have them repaired. I don't know where I got that idea from, but after fully realizing I could completely restore any of these guns by hand, it opened up a world of possibilities. Clean it up, see if I have some ammo for it, maybe. I don't, I don't have crap, who am I kidding? Those shovels are bare, looking like Walmart after Christmas. There we go, now it's in the blue. I got so excited about restoring this AKM that I forgot all about my filthy AUG. I know you're needing some attention, which is probably why <laughs> well, you shouldn't see this. See, it doesn't matter who else I clean. You know at the end of the day, I'm always gonna come back to clean you. Until I go get that new, better gun. <laughs> Cause uh, that thing looks good. I had some ideas for some ways to make some quick cash. I'm gonna accept a couple nearby missions that I've probably already done, honestly. We're gonna go scavenging and knock out this one mission. It's like right in the middle of the radius. This was supposed to be a quick and easy run through Pervame, except it wasn't. How? Did those move? Holy sh That's my poor dead body. Take two, go get some valuables. Okay, back out here. Go a different way. Just to spice things up. But that run didn't last long either. I just realized my life is low. I kind of need to just go home and take a nap. <laughs> I'm gonna die out here. It's embarrassing. I'm already going home. I've been out here for five minutes. I've died. And I'm going to take a nap. I took a much needed nap. Then I went out to have another go at it. But then I realized that a few videos ago, when I repaired all of my armor, yeah, I wasn't in that save file anymore. Oh, that's right. I'll have to repair my stuff again. Yeah. There goes all my hard-earned money. The gun that I want is that much further away. The third attempt went much better. Ha! 
Mwah, har, 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 har. <laughs> One shot! Wow. Who else wants some? Surely there's some other fool who thinks he can take me within the vicinity of this place. Just like taking everybody out, no problem. There is this place, the radius. They call the devil's hole. But which hole is this reference to? Lord knows I don't want to know. Is there anything cool in this junkyard, or is it just a big waste of my time? A Groza magazine? I'm never gonna buy a Groza. I've only read about a Groza with incredible disinterest. There is this place, the radius, where a man must live alone. So where's a man to find some loving every night? Lord knows I don't wanna know. PM magazine. <laughs> Please. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gotta look out for the pubes of death. Blow me down and call me Popeye. Wait, why was I walking through all that gas without a gas mask on? <coughs> oh! <coughs> I totally forgot to put on my gas mask. Now that. There is a stupid man who's died a hundred times. So why is he coming back just to die like that? Lord knows I don't want to know. Here we are running around at night. See, we're not scared anymore. We're going to get everything done here. We're not going home till we get everything done. I think I've hidden up everything over here too. I think I've covered the entire Pervame map. Uh, there should not be any valuables left anywhere at this point. Smoke a cigarette and run home. We're done out here. Back at home base, I sold the stuff I'd found. Oh, nice. Not bad. Not bad at all. I organized the stuff that I wanted to keep. And then I had an even better plan to make some big bucks. I want to go to the factory and wipe that area clean. Like I just did with Pervame. Like, I, I want to go there. There's good stuff there. And I've never really fully explored it because I've always been scared of the factory. But after going to Zorio Foco Shuo's Foz, uh, I'm not scared of anything, honestly. That was the plan. Let the tide pass in a few hours and then find some better loot. Maybe accept a couple missions, too. All right, tide reset. Let's see what we got to do. I'm super excited. Paparazzi, hell no. Call Coast, hell no. Come on. Polo key? What is that? Oh, 3750. We'll take it. The locations mentioned in the descriptions were not entirely accurate. 3120. Oh, the big bucks, baby! Because there were actually multiple locations in a place I was trying to avoid. So that's... Where's that? What map is this? That's... That's where I don't want to go. Man, they're going to make me go there? What is M2? M2 is bull****. M2 is bull****. Forget all of that. This was the plan. So, we're going to the factory route, or map, and we're just gonna like, pew, pew. I'm gonna cover the entire thing. I'm gonna find everything that I can at that map. We're gonna sleep there, which makes me think we should bring another can of food. Can you believe that before this, I had already packed for this trip? Cleaning stuff for my gun? What the hell am I thinking? After some final preparations, I was off. And since I had very little ammo for my AUG, and didn't want to buy more since the AUG would soon be history, I planned to rely mostly on my pistol. Here we go. We are going to absolutely clean out the factory. The factory area map does not stand a chance. Oh. Oh. Oh, they've done gone and moved stuff around again. I always have trouble navigating this part. And there must have been an update because it got more troublesome. I should have had breakfast. Yeah, I bet we'll make 10, maybe 12 Gs. Because that gun's gonna cost like, if you really think about it, it's gonna cost like 16 grand or so to do everything we need to do to that gun and get a big box of ammo. So, we're gonna need the big bucks. And now, a magic trick. Oops. Whoa, whoa, what? Am I a magician? Where did my cigarette go? That's like I'm a magician who accidentally does tricks. I accidentally made my cigarette disappear. Well, ta-da! You guys saw it, what a cool trick. 
The factory was just as I remembered it. Not bad. Anybody home? Oh, that's not an enemy. I mean, if we're gonna explore the whole map, we really gotta clear this thing out. There can't be any survivors. There can't be any survivors. I hate to say it, I hate to be that guy, but we have to kill everyone. There can't be any survivors. To the map of factory, walked a lone man one dark day. If you saw a single monster, then he shot him in the face. He was on some urgent business, wasn't cutting any slack. He's a stranger hunting monsters with a rifle on his back. Rifle on his back. Let's go destroy this rift that keeps making terrifying sounds. I hate terrifying sounds. I'll take it. I won't argue with that. We need that. He was looking for some loot that he could put in his backpack. He's a stranger hunting monsters with a rifle on his back. Rifle on his back. We're just gonna eat this food right quick. We found it. And we're gonna eat it. P2000. We want to carry back all the most valuable weapons we find. We'll leave all of our guns right on this table, right here. Is somebody seriously coming over here? Whoa! Now the stranger made it clear to everyone around that his guns were fully loaded and some sh** was going down. Once a stranger was a pansy, now he's killing just for laughs. He's a stranger hunting monsters with a rifle on his back. Rifle on his back. No, the stranger never withers, never tires, never slows. Unless he's outside sprinting for a few seconds, maybe more. Like a tiger in captivity, he waits to attack. He's a stranger hunting monsters with a rifle on his back. Rifle on his back. To the map of factory, walked a lone man one dark day. If you saw a single monster, then he shot him in the face. He was on some urgent business, wasn't cutting any slack. Let's take out these He's a stranger muffins. hunting monsters with a rifle on his back. Rifle on his back. <sighs> Leaving very few. Sur what is this? Oh, that's the Mosin that everybody's always telling me about. All right, we're taking this gun too. How am I going to run back with all these guns? I had decided I'd make the most profit by taking all of these valuable guns home to sell in multiple trips. Yeah, we're gonna do this in two runs. We're gonna clear out this whole map in two runs. Got nothing to lose. My trip home was pretty uneventful since I had already cleared a path, except for this one mimic policeman who was patrolling all sneaky-like. And now I see him no more. All right. Run with these, here we go. It's good money, guys. It's good money, and we're gonna need it all. In my right was the Mosin, in my left the PP-2000, and the AKM was holstered in my backpack. Three guns for good money if I could just get past this godforsaken obstacle. Oh, sh That godforsaken obstacle. This is the most challenging part for me. But I made it. Cleaned up the guns and sold them all for some damn good money. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, that is enough to get the gun. Let's go ahead and buy it. And then uh, we'll worry we'll worry about the rest later. It was mine. Oh ho 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 oh. It's mine. It's mine. I guess I need a magazine for it. What kind of ammo does it take? I mean at this point it's like a fifteen thousand dollar weapon. Once I put my final scope on it, it'll be closer to Sixteen or seventeen thousand dollars, but man, that's gorgeous. Uh, next video, we're gonna finish cleaning up the whole factory map. Just pew pew pew, clean the whole thing up, take it all out. If you enjoyed the video, tap that like button. Subscribe if you want to stick around. Peace out.